Hey, it's Cameron McKay from The Nashville Show, and we're here at Country for a Cause, the third laser in Nashville. Why are green rooms not green? I don't know. That's a mystery. And there's some amazing artwork all over the wall here. Maybe yours will be up there. Hey, that'll be, I don't know. These are pretty much legends. You know, maybe, you know, in a hundred years. Now, if this lady looks familiar, her name is Wendy Moulton. And uh, where did you come from? I was born and raised in Memphis, Tennessee, yeah. but I've been living in Nashville about 25 years. Now, you were on... The Voice, Voice. season Blake, 21. Blake, Blake's team? Yes, on Team Blake. Okay. That, that, no, but living in Nashville, i got to be on Team Blake. That's right. Uh, now, you were a backup, backup singer for quite a while. Who did you sing for when you were doing that? Uh, a background singer I toured with, first of all, I toured with Julio Iglesias, which is a duet partner for like 15 years. And I had to sing in four languages, and I only speak one. And then... Uh, well, two if you can't profane. Yeah. But he... Um, uh, then I toured with Tim McGraw Faith Hill during their arena tour so, uh, for about 15 years. And then my team with Ride, uh, Vince Gill, and I'll be going out on tour with Vince this summer. Now, I saw the show or the, the film 20, 20 feet. Twenty feet from stardom. stardom. Yeah. yeah. And for those who haven't seen it, it's about trying to make that jump from background singer to being, being the one before the mic. Um, that's not an easy thing to do. And, and I don't know why. It just, it's not been an easy thing to do for a while. It's true, and I had the opposite story. I was a recording artist first, a solo artist, and I was signed to EMI Records, and then it ended, and then I had as to eat, do. as they do, and I had to eat, and then I became a background artist, so I could figure out how to be a solo artist. And uh, so, but I still could relate, because that they were basically saying, you're only 20 feet from stardom. In front of you is stardom. And so I felt like I already felt that a little bit, and then I, and I think I was a bonus background singer because I was sympathetic to how artists change their minds and they want to be creative. So I get that. And that's a lot of thinking on your feet, which you have to do as a solo artist because anything can happen. Anything. Can happen. I, I love both, and I think that you know, singing backgrounds, I, I, was, I didn't have a problem with it. Being supportive, being yes. supportive, and part of it. Pays the bills, and it's still part of the show. It pays the bills, I can figure out how to get back to it. So, are you here at uh, Country for Time? Are you stoked for the show? Absolutely. I mean, legend on top of legend on the show. I don't even know how I got on the show. <laughs> Talent, I think. Well, talent got me in the door so and got me say, on stage. How do you get the Carnegie Hall? Practice, practice, practice. practice? Yeah. yeah. So I'm just happy to be a part of this. You guys need someone, right? Yes, you have each other. You have each other. Who have you? Do you have some music coming out? Or out? Yeah, I'm working on music now. And just going to see the next week, so everything is pretty new. And and so we'll just give it a shot. You know, all this stuff is like talent, but look. Yeah. Oh, we're thrilled to have you, and we're totally want you to come back once you've got some music yes, done. Yes, yes. And we'll talk more. Okay, perfect. Love getting to know you and getting a few minutes with you. Well, thank you for this time. Thank I you, appreciate Wendy. you. Thank you. Wendy for Moten. Me on your show. Ha uh, Wendy Moten, and uh, watch for her new music soon. Uh, we'll try and post some details on our page so you can uh, we get out the people. Excellent. Thank you so much. Nice meeting you too.